Hi everybody, so today's video is going to be on the customizable media cases by Caseable. Um, and they got in contact with me and asked me if I wanted to do a review on one of their products. Um, I said yes because I thought it was quite a novel idea that you could um, sort of put your own like photos, your own design or whatever you wanted on these um, cases for like your media products. Like you can get iPhones, tablets, iPads, laptop cases, stuff like that. It's just a case for everything really. Um, and I went for this design. I'll show you the back, probably a bit better. Um, as you can see, it's sort of this Tokidoki design and it says found on film over there um, with this sort of lime green, pink and white sort of design. Um, there's two options that you can do. You can either design your own or there are some like pre-designed ones on the website. Um, obviously I went for the design your own sort of one and yeah, this is what it came out like. It's sort of a canvassy sort of material um it's really well made this um this black bit here is like a very durable um suede effect it comes with this um little elastic thing to keep it closed when you've got your device in it um the inside looks like this sorry about my very um fingerprinty um samsung tab um as you can see this is a very durable um, suede effect, um, it's got a little design thing here, um, it's also got this little compartment here where you can put like notes or something like that and these four bits of elastic hold your device in place and then you've got the caseable um, little tag there and that's what it looks like on both sides and I really do like it. I do think it's very well made. Um, it's quite hard. It feels quite like hard. Like you know that if this was to drop on the floor, it wouldn't break what is inside because it is quite hard. Um, you can't really bend it, I don't think. Yeah, this feels like it's got sort of a piece of like plastic or something inside it. So you can't really bend it. So, um, you know, that's giving it that extra protection that um, you may need if you were to drop this, for example. Um, none of the like corners or anything are jutting out of your, um, your product. So again, if you were to drop this on the side, it wouldn't affect the actual device itself. So that is what it looks like. This was my old one. This is one that I got from... Um, Argos. This was fourteen ninety nine, and it's this sort of, I think it's fake, but feels quite plastic, um, pink sort of thing, and that's the inside. It's not a durable suede effect, it's just a cheap suede effect, and these are the same sort of tags. These have got a lot more movement in it. This feels like a lot flimsier than the other one. Um, so yeah, this is this was fourteen ninety nine, and this is where we come on to the price of this. Now, when I saw the price of these, I was like, "Are you kidding? This is quite expensive." And these for this anyway are thirty nine ninety, which is so expensive. Um, but then you sort of look at this and think, "I paid fourteen ninety nine for that." You know, and this is really cheap and it's not going to protect anything at all because it hasn't got the um, thing to keep it shut. But, you know, that's the sort of budget end. But this is, you can see why it costs so much because it is really sturdy and you do feel like your product's going to be safe in there. But £39.90 is a lot of money for a case for something. I suppose it depends how you look at it. I mean... I can go out now and know that this is going to be keeping my product really safe and I suppose paying the 39.90 is better than having to pay another like 200 pound or whatever the tablet is these days. So I don't know. I personally probably wouldn't pay 39.90 for these. 
and I think the shipping is something like seven pounds because I think it comes from either Belgium or America. I think the the company's based in those two places. Um, but I personally don't think I would buy it. But I do think that it's very, very good quality and you can definitely tell why it is that much. Um, I think that this would be a good sort of idea if like you were, you had your own business and like say you were like a driving instructor and your brand was on the outside of your car. You can like do appointments and stuff on your iPad or whatever. And possibly having one of these with your like logo on would be a good thing just to, you know, tie it in. But other than that, I think it's a novel idea that you can have like your own design put on it and it is very good quality. I've probably said that a billion times, but I don't, I don't know if I can justify the price. If it was like around 25, 30 pound maybe, but it's like, it's almost 40 pounds. Um, I suppose it's sort of hit and miss thing. If you have the money to spend on um, getting your own one of these designed and made for you and everything, then this is definitely a good way to do it because the quality is amazing. So yeah, you have the expensive and the cheap. You can definitely tell the difference. So that is my review on Kersable. So thank you very much for watching and I will see you all again soon. Adios.